guys, it's Justice. Welcome to episode two of Tips and Tricks. Here is our question for this episode. My wife and I just moved into a new place and our second floor is carpeted and our previous owners had dogs. They had already shampooed and cleaned the rug thoroughly. However, when we moved in, our dog Minnie here, first thing she did was go upstairs and start marking. How do we stop that behavior? Marking inside is not entirely uncommon when you're dealing with a new house. And on top of it, if she can smell the other dog's pee, Mm. So you want to make sure you clean the area with a really good odor neutralizer, like Nature's Miracle. It has enzymes in it that will remove the odor of her urine, and so she won't be apt to mark there again. The next thing you want to do is really limit her freedom in the new house. Only give her a couple of rooms that she's allowed to hang out in. If Minnie can go a month or so without having any accidents in the rooms that you're giving her access to, you can slowly increase her access to all of the rooms in the house. Eventually she'll start to see the new home just like she saw her old home and she won't want to pee inside. So the trick we're going to teach for this episode is roll over, one of my favorites. I'm going to start off with a treat at my dog's nose and lure him into a down. I want my dog's head to curl around into his body and for him to go over onto one of his hips. So I'm going to swing my arm around over his head like this and lure him over and give him the treat. Once your dog is reliably following the lure and moving over onto his hip, the next step is just to continue luring him around in the circle. Roll over. Good boy. If you get that down a few times in a row, you can start to add a hand signal. Roll over. Good boy. Give me five. 